Yeah, what a story it is, Joe and Micah. These two were originally supposed to be married, as you said, uh, in the fall, but they got married yesterday. It seems that working in healthcare in this pandemic changed their priorities, and they decided to get uh, hitched in front of a building they both love very much. It's a safe bet to say the ER at Chicago's Stroger Hospital may be the center of care for COVID-19 patients here. But it's also the start of a love story for Victoria Gonzalez and Eric Lesser, both now emergency room physicians. I was, uh, well, I was a student and I walked into an overnight shift in January and Eric was the senior resident taking sign out and we had about two shifts together. And then after our second shift, he asked me out. That was 2016. There were more dates and then love. He makes me laugh every day. He's so funny. He's, he's such a great pet parent. He's a great doctor. She's smart. Uh, she's so funny. Uh, she's beautiful. I am so lucky. I'm so lucky. He proposed in Grand Cayman right after she was stung by a stingray. And they set the date, October 2020. But then, in the middle of planning that, they found themselves on the front lines of the pandemic. I think it's pretty surreal just because you're seeing all ages get affected. There's been a lot of uncertainty. Uh, you know, the, the doctors and the nurses are, I mean, just really, really giving it their all. Um, it's just, you know, it's everyone's afraid, but, you know, we've got a job to do and we're doing it. But in the midst of that uncertainty at work came resolve for one another. They decided to move the date up. It definitely brought sort of what's most important to the to the forefront because it's really just like you and me and our officiant and our ring bearer. Ten year old Brody, their ring bearer, was one of just a few who yesterday congregated outside the old Cook County Hospital as Eric and Victoria, two ER doctors wanting to save lives, affirmed their lives together. We don't know what's going to happen. You know, we're taking all the safety precautions that we can. But, you know, I didn't want to waste any more time. She didn't want to waste any more time. We love each other. We knew this was right, and we just wanted to make sure that this got done. Now, Eric uh, is from the Chicago area. His parents, his siblings were able to make it here for the ceremony. Of course, they kept their distance and have face masks on. Victoria's family lives in Colorado. They were able to watch on FaceTime. They are hoping that by the time October comes around when their wedding was supposed to be, it'll be safe enough to have some sort of reception to get everyone together and celebrate their new love together and their new life together. Uh, for the meantime, they are back to helping others in the ER. That's the latest here live in the Illinois Medical District tonight. Sean Lewis, WGN News.